Ciao, siamo in Roma. In front of, we're in Rome, and we're in front of the Pantheon, one of the greatest examples of Roman architecture still around. The dome, when you go inside, the dome, you can see there's a hole in the very top, and it just holds all the pressure up, and it's just truly an amazing structure, and you really should check it out. Okay, now, the topic for today, for today's topic, is the simple path. Now, there's the simple past, and then there's what's called the imperfect. The simple past is something that happened in the past, and it's done. You know, like, I ate. Oh, mangiato. I ate. It's done. It's over. Okay? Things like that. Now, if when you form it... When you form the past tense, the simple past, okay, there's two forms. Um, you either use avere, have, like I have done, okay, this kind of form, or essere, like sono andato. Now, there's two different ways to use it. With avere, you use transitive verbs, okay? Things like you did something to somebody, or you gave someone something, things like that, okay? Those are with the avere. So let's review. The avere, like I have, it's in the present tense. Yo o, tu, yo o, tu I. Lui a, lui a, noi abbiamo, noi abbiamo, voi avete. Voi avete, e loro hanno. Okay, now when you do this, you, you say the O, the Averi, plus the uh, past participle of any verb, okay, that you want to use. Alright, so mangiare, mangiare is to eat. So drop off that ARE and you add ATO, so mangiato. Yo mangiato. So you say I ate, O mangiato. O mangiato. Okay, you want to say you saw, like vedere. Okay, well, if it is, well, that's a irregular. I'll do it in a video inside of the irregulars to give you some of it. You saw? I visto. Oh, did you see that? I visto. Okay, did you see the kids? Oh, I visto. I bambini. Did you see the children? Okay. Now, the general way is that you make the past participle. Okay, the A-R-E, like I said, you drop the A-R-E off and add A-T-O. So, cantare, cantato. Cantare, so to cantato. The E-R-E. So like credere, to believe, credere, you drop the E-R-E -E off and add U-T-O. So it's creduto, no creduto, I didn't believe it, no ho creduto, okay? Now the I-R-E verbs, you drop off the I-R-E and add I-T-O. So dormire is dormito, dormir, dormito, okay? So, you know the avere, that's what tracks of like I, um, I ate, ho mangiato, I sang, o cantato. Now, when you use a stere, those are intransitive, like movement, like I go, I went, okay? So you know the so, like a stere is to be, so sono, io sono, tu sei, lui è, noi siamo, voi siete, loro sono. And so with these, you gotta make sure that the ending matches, okay? If it's, we did it, okay, it needs to be, um, like if I say, I go, Yo sono andato, okay, andare, andato, io sono andato, but if I say we went, okay, noi siamo andati, because andati, because we is plural, okay, now, if Jocelyn here, if she goes, okay, le a, no, sorry, le e andata, okay, she went, because it's the a at the end, because it's feminine, okay, le e andata, alright, now, with these, you know, there's different kinds of forms, and there's lots of irregulars, okay? So this is just to give you a, a normal idea of the actual, most set up ones. I'll do a video inside so you can see, and I'll give you some of the more pop, more popular, more commonly used um, past participles that are irregular. Okay, so, ciao.